The race is on for companies to gain a strong foothold in emerging countries that have growing appetites for snack foods and beverages. One of the most enticing prospects is China, a market known perhaps as much for its complexity and diversity as for its potential. My name is Carol Wingard. I've been a partner with LEK Consulting now for close to 15 years. I'm one of the founding partners of the China practice. A leading global brand was targeting exponential growth. New levels of prosperity in urban and rural China were creating enormous growth opportunities. The company enlisted LEK Consulting to help it gain market share quickly in these hotly contested regions. The client hired us for a number of reasons. First, we've had really a long-standing practice and a couple of offices in China for many years and have a strong understanding of the retailing and consumer product landscape. In addition, I think we're also we're quite adventurous, and this project required us to travel extensively in the hinterlands in, in China to gather the information. And uh, we're, we're quite good at rolling up our sleeves and getting involved in the action. A key challenge was making sense of China's diverse and rapidly changing retail landscape. The challenges that the client was facing actually are very good ones to have. It's really a question more of how to best take advantage of an opportunity, that of the rapidly growing uh, consumer population in China. China is a land of opportunity, but it's also a land of complexity. LEK took a highly complex and diverse environment and mapped how specific markets perform today and how they are projected to evolve. The work scope encompassed all of China, actually, all, all of the provinces, but we focused most of our initial investigation on the two provinces, uh, Jiangsu and Shandong province. The scope of our work, actually, what, what we did was look at two provinces, a number of cities to benchmark uh, thousands of cities throughout China with a total population of you know, well over twice that of North America. Teams from LEK's China offices segmented China's city markets into four primary socioeconomic tiers with multiple variations based on geography. In some parts of China, you, you know, you have large trucks that might be carrying our clients beverages and, and snack food products. In other locations, you have people delivering on motor scooters and some locations on ox carts. It just depends on adapting to the local requirements. LEK created an easy-to-use market channel optimization application that the client's field employees use to help evaluate and prioritize new markets. One of the key issues is at what point are consumers ready for, say, certain snack food products? Only at a certain level of, of, of income or sort of retailer availability do people start eating snack foods. And, and once they're at that level, what kind do they eat? What do they prefer? What kinds of brands do they prefer? Those are some, some of the indicators that will help us understand when do we, when, when do we launch types of products. LEK articulated a detailed strategy to optimize distribution and sales opportunities for each market profile category. There's quite a big difference between a more developed city or and a transitional city in terms of the amount of modern retail. How many Walmarts and Carrefours do they have uh, as a distribution, as, as a retailing method versus the small mom and pops? The food and beverage company is seeing increased sales in China, especially in the tertiary markets. The company also continues to use LEK's application to gain insight into distribution models for new markets and maintain its leadership position throughout China. We gathered the, the insight from the marketplace to create tools for our client to use in, in terms not only of strategy development, but in terms of practical day-to-day uh, -day, so managerial involvement. So we were able to turn over a working um, analytic tool uh, to the regional sales and marketing directors that they could use in order to uh, help them assess how they were performing in different cities or, you know, relative to what expectations might be. The client was extremely satisfied with both the strategic framework that we were able to give them as sort of illuminating the, the changing nature of their go-to-market points ar around China as well as this very practical tool uh, that they continue to use in modified form today. Um, they've seen their sales grow exponentially, and we like to think that uh, we're a good contributory to, to that result.